I believe, flexibility and the ability to look at things in a number of different ways and not always accept the first answer as the right one, be able to look at alternative ideas, be able to hear suggestions from other people and maybe be able to change your mind or maybe reinforce your own original position. When we got to the end, we looked at the gold list and we had really strong options. We started to have a preliminary discussion about what might be a Grand Leah, but we realized that there was no automatic response. And we were looking for that automatic response. This is the only choice. It wouldn't have even had to have come to a conversation if we knew there was one piece of work that was clearly outstanding from the others. I love pep Pepto-Bismol, I thought it was incredibly strong. The scoring work was really well done in terms of storytelling, in terms of the instrumentation, it feeling unexpected. I also loved Old Navy, I also loved Mumbai, both being very important and relevant culturally and socially at this point. It's been incredible, and I think everyone has been very warm and welcoming and supportive of us. And the room is dynamic. There are a lot of opinions in there. We have a lot of, come from a lot of varied backgrounds and experiences, but it is uh, congenial at the same time and really what we're looking for is the best work, to elevate the best work, because everyone else's best work elevates our own best work. I think a lot of people are interested in being in our space, because we're no longer doing 30-second commercials or 15-second commercials only and then calling it a day. We're doing, for Everything that we put on TV, we, for the most part, will do some kind of long form film that's attached to it. It's an, there's, the opportunity for music is really manifold on every project. So that's really attractive. And we're doing a lot of work that is content, that is branded, and it's not necessarily obviously branded. We're looking for tremendous entertainment value and what better way to enhance and support and um, reach out to people than music to tell your story. So I think it's a great time for music. Labels and publishers are interested in working with us all the time. They are really great collaborators of ours. Um, it's much easier from a technical standpoint to produce a track these days. You don't have to be a composer who works in a recording studio. You can be in your bedroom, in your basement, and you can be creative. And there are more ways for us to hear that work than ever in the past. I think it's so needed. We work in a time where things are moving so, so quickly. And there's a real need for I think both things for young people, which is a sense of history, of a knowledge of how the business works, how the business is structured, and having a solid foundation in that, but also having a foundation that is based in having access to people who are doing the, really the cutting edge, newest kind of work, because the agency world is, is really, it's, it's not the agency world, it's a technology world, uh, it's a music world. It's a sponsorship world. It's all those things in, in one. It's a new media world. Don't settle and don't think that you know the answers right away, even when the answer seems very obvious in front of you. There's always another potential answer, and you may come back to your first answer, but I found over the years that the, the journey is often needed 
you know, exploration is probably the most powerful thing you can do with music. We also have ability to explore now these days with the technology in ways we couldn't do as easily in the past.